What is up, guys? Blake Baker back. Uh, just wanted to check in with you guys, see how everybody's doing. Hope everybody's having an awesome week so far. Um, it's been a little bit, but I'm back on the YouTube, and I'm going to be more consistent about this. So, uh, what have I been doing? I just got back from Florida, went out there to Orlando to the uh, the Remax World Conference, which was a super cool experience. Got to go out there with my Remax five star team. Uh, we had a good time. We learned a lot. We met a lot of awesome Remax agents from not only the United States, uh, but all across the world, uh, Uruguay, Argentina, uh, Africa, um, and then, you know, met several agents from Arizona, Iowa, California, Florida, New York. It's really cool to get everybody's perspective and see how everybody else's market is kind of kind of moving and it's pretty similar to how ours is right now so it's been a pretty crazy year for me so far i'm uh a little bit ahead of where i was this time last year which is good um one of the main things that i've changed up this year is you know i'm from pasadena so a lot of my business comes from pasadena deer park report um but i've been really scattering the map this year um, my last closings have been well pasadena and then we have Santa Fe, Seabrook, Laporte, Alvin, Shore Acres, Kima, Rocheron, uh, Santa Fe. Yeah, so kind of moving down 45 a little bit, uh, kind of being able to scatter the map and learn different things about different markets. And I've found that it's really helped me when showing buyers, uh, just getting that extra experience and getting that extra knowledge and knowing different markets so that's cool um the state of the market right now in my personal opinion uh when you you know people say oh it's crazy right now it is crazy um the problem is is i don't think it's very sustainable um so here's some stats uh february 21 compared to february 2020 um, so total property sales have only gone up 1.9%. We were seeing a crazy growth in sales and it's kind of slowing down. Uh, total dollar volume has gone up 17%. This one is crazy. Total active listings down 37.9%. That's insane. Uh, let's see. Single family months inventory has gone down 1.7 months. So there was 3.3 months of inventory this time last year. Now there's only 1.6. And the pending sales have gone up 11.6%. So what does that mean? Uh, it's still a good time to buy in the sense that interest rates are still good. Um, you can still get below 3%. I had a buyer yesterday sign at 3%. Uh, but there's no homes to buy. So, well, there is, but it's just, it's really competitive right now. Really, really competitive. Um, I'm seeing buyers coming in and, you know, I had one in Clear Lake that there, it was $160 a foot and there was no comps above $135 a foot. And the listing agent said they had offers over asking price. So it just makes zero sense to me. It's like comps are out the window in some senses. Um, so I, I would advise buyers to be very careful about overpaying right now. Um, but most of them are going over asking price and we're having buyers that are saying, Hey, we'll waive our right to terminate due to the appraisal. We will pay 10, $20,000 over the appraised price. Just throw some extra cash down to make up the difference for the sellers. And that's, that's the state of the market right now. So if you're a seller, it's killer, you know? But uh, yeah, trying to find something is, is a little bit tough right now. So that being said, if you know anybody that needs to sell or buy, uh, send them my information, have them follow me on Instagram. Instagram's usually the best way to get a hold of me. Uh, shoot me a DM. If you don't have my number, you can always text me, call me. Uh, my information's on my link tree in my bio. And that's pretty much it. I will talk to you guys later.